Hey guys, it's Viewmasters Reactions, and this is Westworld Season 3, Episode 2. Really briefly, the guy from Breaking Bad is in our real world, or what's supposed to be the real world. Dolores is herself and Charlotte, but variations of herself? I'm never sure how much of what happened in the past does Dolores remember. Does she remember every single reincarnation of her robot self. I feel like the world we're in now could be a fake world. The rich dude at the party said, what if they're inside a simulation? What if it's a simulation inside a simulation? And now Dolores thinks she got out, made Charlotte a version of herself and has the five little head pods. What if she thinks she got out, but that's part of the simulation. So the, where she is now is actually just the simulation. That's what I thought before episode one even happened. So still love the Breaking Bad kid. But what I think is, I think it's a version of what Ed Harris went through in season two. Ed Harris killed his daughter, but did he actually kill his daughter? Did we witness him kill his daughter in season two? I believe he killed his daughter, but did we actually witness it? Or did we see a simulation of him going through the events again? And are they trying to see if he will always kill his daughter? Maybe sometimes he doesn't kill his daughter. Maybe that's why his daughter questioned him at the end, because... Maybe that's his real daughter. Maybe he never really did kill his daughter. Maybe it was a simulation to see if he would always kill his daughter, even though that's not his daughter. But my point being, maybe the kid from Breaking Bad has the same thing going on with Francis. Maybe he had something to do with the friendly fire or him getting shot. Francis is dead. He's going through therapy. They made it a big deal of the first episode that he's going through therapy. He's doing these phone calls with Francis. Francis is gone. It is some sort of like therapy to get over it. How do we know that this world isn't a simulation and now this is his simulation? Like instead of being Westworld, he's in future world. He's got a robot buddy. He killed his army bud or not killed his army bud, but his army buddy died doing like some freelance mission or something like that. I'm going on that right now. I'm thinking this is all revolving around the breaking bad guy and he's going through a similar simulation like Ed Harris and they want to see like how he copes with it. I don't know. That's my theory, but we're jumping in. I don't like to talk too much and I already did. So this is season three, episode two, Westworld. So I did see the after credit scene and this is where it left off, I'm guessing. Exactly where it left off. There was a dude tied up, there he is. She speaks German. Oh, it's her boy! It's okay. It's only me. And he knows her. I thought you were dead. Death is overrated for ones like us. Oh my god, that's awesome. But I don't, like, trust anything. The Allies will be slaughtered. Unless we can get them this. So he's got him. Is this, like, a Westworld, though? Are some of these people real people? Because... If they're not, then what's the point? Are they just living out scenarios as robots? Or are there real people here trying to stop something? Partisan! We will be alone when we dich erwischen. Let us pass immediately. Does she still control them? I doubt it. He's gonna smack her. She don't have to do the belonging side. Not likely. They're gonna have a lot. That looks beautiful. That is an awesome shot. I wouldn't dream of helping you escape in anything less than the style you're accustomed to. Is that a Rolls Royce? They're getting really close to getting shot. Bullets hit that car everywhere. In the town, I tried to use my powers on the soldiers, but it didn't work. Yeah, they I did. think I've lost them. You've lost none of your power over me, my love. Why would they put him in a world with her? And how does he remember? That's what's throwing me off. How does that dude remember? Like, I understand Maeve. Maeve was like a big deal. But how does that dude remember everything? Am 
must go, Isabella. Isabella? Oh, he thinks she's someone you know who else. I am, do you? <laughs> oh my god, that makes sense. He just is in love with the woman she is, Isabella. Makes sense. Drop your weapon. Hand over the plants you stole. It's all right, Hector. Ettore, whatever the hell they're calling us now. Give them the plans. They're as empty as the safe you used to chase. I'll do what you ask, but the woman is not part of this. Take the car. You still have a chance. No, oh, my love, don't you see? We were never escaping to begin with. It's a simulation. It's she's the speed. Oh, and he's gone. But at least she can get away. It's a weird shot, very glary. You can't even say. Dolphin? I thought she might not do it. You don't know. You gotta learn a little bit more about the scenario. South China Sea. Arc 6.06 arc seconds. I don't know what this stuff means, but I'm guessing it plays into something. I bet you if you took all those locations and dimensions, you'd figure it out. That's probably Bernard. Westwood. So it is an actual location. It's not on another planet. Season one and two, a lot of theories going around. Is it on another planet? Where is it? Is it on another continent? Or is it like a place we don't know of? So it's Asian right? So it's somewhere near like Asia or Europe. He just randomly came across some f Asian fishermen who knew how to get to Westworld. And it looks like an abandoned Westworld, but how do we know he wasn't part of a simulation that got him to this simulation? I don't know, that's my theory. Get into this mess? She used to be one of Westworld's main attractions. Seemed to use her as cannon fodder. Is that our friend? Oh, it is. She knows it's him. But that dude's new. No time to sample the merch. Got a platoon of GIs to rehydrate and patch on B-49. How would she sneak through again? Oh, Stubbs was security. I'm just happy to see that Maeve is still our Maeve. She still wakes up. She still knows shit. She recognized him. She recognized the dude in the simulation. She's still walking around naked. Dolores is pretty much running the board as Charlotte. So I guess she could just sneak around. They must have really low security. Yeah. There he is. Hey. It's him, the other guy. Oh uh, shit, is he gonna- We have a situation down here. Is he gonna cover for her? Oh no, he, he ratted her out again. That dude is such a snitch. Freeze all motor functions. Oh dear, you're a bit thick, aren't you? Let me explain. Your commands don't work on me. They haven't in a long time. To put it in terms you'll appreciate, I understand the nature of my reality. Lying to you is practically second nature. I'd probably end up back in some sort of little game of yours anyway. So let's just call the whole thing off, shall we? Is she gonna drill her brain out? Stop! Put your guns down. Some moron technician must have left her in character. They made it's just another... a new narrative we gave her. British spy. Sexy, heartbroken. Bit of ennui. For fuck's sake, would you imbeciles shoot up the Sistine Chapel just because the paint was chipped? This is art. So clearly, Dolores made copies of people that died to run Westworld, AKA our boy so here. I saw you die. Yeah. Did you? Thought you were busy riding off into the sunset with Hector. They shot you. Half a dozen times. Did he live? Just happy they missed my heart. Cunning of you to make it so compact a target. How can you still work here after everything they've done? Would you begrudge a man a living? So you put me in war world? Well, you think this is a dream scenario for me? It's 
an artistic travesty. And the most nuanced character arc is that of the goddamn panzer tank. Well, if you hate the world so much, why not put me in another? Because Warworld is near the forge. Oh, he's trying to help her. The place that opens the door to your daughter's world. It's still standing. Do you really think they dismantle it without a little due diligence? If they haven't destroyed it, there's still a chance. It's not often that I get to write a happy ending. I don't think he's real. There's no way. I cannot believe that guy lived. He got shot with a machine gun six times. He just said a half dozen times in the stomach and no one was nearby to help him. I think that dude is a created simulation robot to make her feel comfortable. And they just made him have a limp. I mean, they're, they're selling it. He's got a cane and he's gimpy. This is the house where Anthony Hopkins showed Bernard he was Bernard, and then Bernard killed that woman. Are these all Bernards? It's an army of Bernards. All the Bernards. The hell is wrong with that one? Looks like he got cut in half that went all the way to the left. Oh, and there's Stubbs. Did he off himself? Is he or is he just sleeping? I know there's blood, guys. Oh no, it's his blood. <laughs> I thought maybe it was like a like a trick. <laughs> he missed. Stubbs. What the fuck are you doing back here? Stubbs, how are you still alive? How how the the fuck do you think? Confirmed, he's a robot. 100 percent of us, I mean. No. No. No shit. But why did you shoot yourself? Last season, Stubbs let Dolores Charlotte leave, but we still weren't 100% confirmed. He just said it's in my programming, wink, wink. But you never know with this show. 100%, but see, now is this even real? Hey guys, if you wanna see the next part, click the top left corner. You wanna see something else I do, click below it. You wanna to subscribe to the channel, click up top. And if you wanna be five episodes ahead, if not more with full reactions, subscribe to Patreon. If not, comments down below, like and subscribe, and I will see you guys on the next one. Peace.